by a dolphin. Are you kidding me? Good afternoon, honorable judges, ladies and gentlemen, fellow 4-H members. My name is Georgia Polissa, and this February my family went on the trip to Puerto Vallarta, Mexico. When I asked my dad if he wanted to swim with the dolphins with me, he said, no way. My brother Alex didn't want to go either. I think that is because my dad kept on telling him, the dolphin was going to eat me. On our second morning in Mexico, we went to Dolphin Adventure. Dad and Alex went over to the viewing area. Their job was to take our pictures. I was hoping this wouldn't turn out to be a disaster. Dolphins do not understand Spanish or English, so Mom and I had to learn some basic hand signals. We all got into the pool, and two dolphins named Cleo and Java swam in front of us so we could have a feel. They felt like wet inner tubes. Dolphins shed their skin every two hours, and that's what makes them faster swimmers. I was hoping that they would wait until I was out of the pool to do that. Every time the dolphins obeyed a command, their trainer gave them a treat. When I held out my hands like this, Cleo gave me a big kiss. I was surprised she didn't have fish breath. Dolphins have teeth on the top and the bottom. They swallow their food without chewing it. See, Dad, I told you the dolphin wasn't going to eat me. In the pool, I held onto the boogie board and locked my knees. Cleo and Java swam up, put their noses on each of my feet, and then I was off for a ride on the board. Good thing I wore my goggles. There was water going everywhere. Next, I held my hands like this. When Cleo swam under me, I grabbed both of her fins, and then she took me across the pool, belly to belly. I couldn't believe that I was swimming with a dolphin. It felt awesome. Sadly, my day with the dolphins was over. I know, when I go back to Mexico, I will definitely swim with the dolphins again. And I wouldn't be surprised if two other people, I won't mention their names, will want to come too.